Netflix has established specific standards and criteria that cameras need to meet in order to be used for shooting content for their platform. These guidelines aim to guarantee that the footage shot is of excellent quality and meets Netflix expectations. However, these cameras aren't affordable for everyone. In today's video, we will showcase the 5 best affordable cameras that meet Netflix criteria and can be used for producing content for Netflix or other professional projects without spending a lot of money. The BS-1H is an ultra-compact full-frame box-style camera that offers beautiful video performance for live and cinema applications. Equipped with a 24.2 megapixel full-frame sensor with dual native ISO technology, the camera boasts 6K video capabilities and multiple recording modes, making it an ideal tool for professional photographers and videographers. It also features heat management for unlimited video recording. The BS-1H offers exceptional video performance including 14 plus stops of V-Log and V-Gamut, 12-bit raw video data output over HDMI for external monitor, simultaneous internal and external recording, and anamorphic morphic mode. Moreover, the camera supports simultaneous 6K at 24 frames per second, 4 to 2 to 0 10-bit internal recording, and 4K 4 to 2 to 2 10-bit HDMI live output external recording. The BS-1H also allows for the output of raw video data over HDMI to save as Apple ProRes RAW on the Atomus Ninja V 4K HDR monitors or Blackmagic RAW on Video Assist 12G HDR. Other features that enable seamless production include simultaneous SDI HDMI output, genlock and timecode in and out, and linear and non-linear focus ring control. Thanks to a cooling fan that keeps the BS-1H within the operating temperature range, you can enjoy unlimited recording without worrying about overheating. Here's another camera from Panasonic. The Lumix S1H is a full-frame mirrorless camera designed for film production with professional-level standards. It boasts extensive recording modes and cinematic image quality to meet the demands of today's creators. A newly developed 24.2 megapixel full-frame image sensor with dual-native ISO technology and Venus engine signal processing achieves high sensitivity and minimum noise. The camera provides 14-plus stops of dynamic range, which is as wide as those of cinema cameras, and is V-Log and V-Gamut compatible with popular calorimetry called Verica Look. The S1H is also designed for active filming in the field when attached to a gimbal or drone, thanks to its dust, splash, freeze-resistant design that withstands heavy field use under harsh conditions for high mobility. The Lumix S1H full-frame mirrorless camera system adopts the L-mount system, providing users with a diverse and future-proof range of products. Additionally, the camera offers 6K 10-bit video recording, including full area 3 to 2 6K at 24 frames per second, anamorphic modes, and an unlimited recording time in an all-recording modes thanks to unique heat dispersion technologies. All of these features make the Lumix S1H a top-of-the-line choice for filmmakers and videographers who demand exceptional quality and durability. The Blackmagic Ursa Mini Pro 4.6K G2 was launched by Blackmagic Design in March 2019 as an upgraded version of the previous Ursa Mini Pro released in March 2017. This new digital film camera is equipped with advanced electronics and an exceptional 4.6K HDR image sensor that can capture footage up to 300 frames per second. It also features a super 35mm 4.6K sensor with 15 dynamic range stops, an interchangeable EF lens mount which can be replaced with PL, B4 or F mounts, and built-in optical ND filters. The camera can record in Blackmagic RAW and ProRes to dual CFast or dual SD cards and has a USB-C expansion port for recording directly to external discs. The Orsa Mini Pro 4.6K G2 also includes external broadcast style controls, a backlit status display, a fold-out touchscreen monitor, and several other features. It can shoot in various resolutions with different high-speed frame rates available in Blackmagic RAW, UHD windowed, and HD windowed. Additionally, it has a 4-position ND filter wheel, autofocus with compatible lenses, iris control, a 4-inch LCD capacitive touchscreen, a highly accurate timecode clock, an SDI 12G output, and dual XLR audio inputs. 
Next up on the list, the Panasonic EVA 1 is a camera that was eagerly anticipated by many in the filmmaking community as it marked Panasonic's return to the mid-range cinema camera market after a long absence. With the EVA 1, Panasonic sought to prove that it was still a major player in the cinema camera market. The EVA 1 offers a number of impressive features, including 4K internal recording, 5.7K raw output via a future firmware upgrade, and a version of the dual native ISO that has made the very cam so popular. Moreover, the camera boasts Panasonic's signature ergonomics, build quality, and color mapping, which many filmmakers have come to love. Perhaps the most exciting feature of the EVA 1 is its dual native ISO, which allows the camera to achieve high-quality low-light footage with minimal grain. While the camera's native ISO values of 800 and 2500 may not be as high as those of some other cameras on the market, they are still incredibly fast and should offer filmmakers a lot of flexibility when shooting in low-light conditions. With its impressive feature set and lightweight design, it seems likely that EVA 1 will be a popular choice for many filmmakers in the years to come. And finally, for Canon C300 users who want to upgrade to 4K without losing the original camera's look and feel, the EOS C300 Mark II is an appealing option. It is designed to be user-friendly for documentary, reality, event, and sports videographers on the go, with a Super 35 sensor, an 8-bit 4-2-2 MXF-wrapped file suitable for broadcast workflows and formats. The C300 Mark II has DCI 4K and UHD resolutions, which can be recorded to Canon's XFAVC codes. 4K recording is 10-bit 4-2-2, but it is limited to 30 frames per second, whereas other cameras in the same range can record 4K at 60fps internally. Canon also offers the C300 Mark II ENG package, which includes a Zakuto ENG rig, Zakuto Gradical Viewfinder, and Canon CineServo EF lens. The camera records the dual CF 2.0 cards with an SD slot recording long GOP 2K and 4K in photo JPEG codec. However, CF 2.0 cards are quite expensive compared to other media options. While the control positions may be different for EOS cinema cameras, the C300 Mark II has well-labeled controls making it easy to change settings without having to navigate multiple menus. So, this was our list of the 5 best affordable Netflix-approved cameras. Which one did you like the most? Do let us know if we missed another model that should have been on this list down in the comments below. And as for everything else, like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this on your feed.